Alright guys, and we're back. Yeah, sorry about that. Uh, we... Oh, good. It's good to see that we come back and the speed is just as good as it was the first time. <laughs> yeah. I blame the Twilight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna, we're gonna make our way through Elden. And hopefully while we're here, we're gonna meet some uh, lovely new cat. Oh, there we go. There's a lovely new character. <laughs> yes. The bird with the split open neck, or that has a mouth for a neck. Yes, a mouth for a neck. He's got to. He's got to eat through something. Yeah. Uh -huh. I'm assuming he's got to have. A, I guess he has like teeth, like a blender, sort of. You know, he drills the food so... as it goes through. Well, you're looking for bugs, so I think you want to light the torch. This isn't the bomb. This isn't the bomb room, right? No, it's not. No, that's right. That's up on the hill. Is. That's that's right. That's up on the hill on the other side. There Hello, we go. gentlemen. Oh, nah. Excuse me. <laughs> da, 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 da. Congratulations. <laughs> Break the... <laughs> Break the property! Yeah, I'm sure nobody was gonna use those boxes for anything. Oh, I already destroyed, like, one or two of the tables. Yes. Oh my goodness, a blue rupee! <laughs> <laughs> Who could have guessed? <laughs> Fucking, I'm, I'm dying, holy shit. The game gave me a, a goddamn heart attack. Who could have guessed that there was a blue rupee here the whole time? Yes, I mean, I, for I forgot what it was, so... Oh. Yeah, I think somebody left a comment on the video, I don't know how accurate it is, but I don't really care enough to, to look this up myself to confirm whether it's true, but I'm gonna cite it anyways. <laughs> uh, but I think, I think they said something about, like, for whatever reason, I think it was like a design oversight, they basically coded the, the whole rupee thing. It was like, in the, like, the RAM? The rant, that's the, uh, which kind of deletes every time you turn the game on or off or whatever, so... Oh, yeah. So that's why it does that. Ah. So I don't know why the... <laughs> You'd think that they'd realize not to do that with the next game that they make. Right, because that, 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 the weird thing is that remained consistent. Like, if it was, it was a design oversight here, I could get that, but they... I guess, I guess the, I guess they did an opinion poll and... Everyone's like, we want to be, we want to be treated like we're fucking morons. More, please. <laughs> Condescend to me, game designers. So They're like, well, I mean, that's what the majority ones. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta burn them. You gotta burn them out. There we go. Yeah. yeah. Now I got fire. Uh, that fire is way too I close. Am man. Way too close to his face. I. I don't know. He's kind of tilting it's it up. It's not even really fire. It's just a glowing stick. Oh yeah, what, what, wait, what? Where's the fire? I think the... It's like the, the emulator. The emulator's crapping out more ways than one. Jesus. Where'd that bug go? Man, this this game, this, play, this playthrough is really giving a glowing endorsement to, uh... <laughs> to whatever emulator we're using. Mm-hmm. You know, slow down. The graphics do look good on this one. Like, everything oh, no, I look, is very sharp. Right, well, at least with the emulator, like, I mean, you, you got, you were able to get, like, HD footage of, like, uh, Twilight Princess for your last few episodes, and... Well, that, I, technically, I got that from, uh, someone else's channel, but... Yeah. They use this same e emulator, so... Right, right. Yeah. Where am I going? Um, just, you're just breaking into houses at this, uh, at this point, so, I don't know. Oh, hey, it's the hot spring. Yeah. It's dry! This is a piece of shit place! That, that is the biggest injustice of the twilight, just drying up the hot spring. Yeah. I mean, that's gonna affect tourism. That's like 30% of their profits just gone. Mm-hmm. You know, worst thing oh, about my the, <laughs> Worst thing about the twilight, worst fucking thing. I mean, yeah, monsters, huge problem, but goddamn is this gonna hurt tourism. <laughs> Our small town relies so heavily on that shit. I like how I can see the spirit all the way over there when I have my senses on. Yeah. Well, you can still see him even without the senses. Yeah, that is true. Yeah. Let's see, how do I get in here? 
probably have to dig. The light was ordained by the goddesses themselves. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, let me tell you about the. This would make robbing this place very easily. <laughs> yeah. Well, very, very robbable homes these people have here. <laughs> Fuck you. I mean, even with a complete lack of like manual like dexterity, you can still slip into these people's homes with relative ease. It's. I feel like anybody with hands would be very easily able to just come on in, steal your boxes filled with money, your easily breakable wooden boxes filled with money. That apparently well, I do that even when they're home. So yeah. <laughs> I don't really know if that really matters I, I guess, much. Yeah, I guess the people don't give a shit. I mean, you 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 know you can swing your sword at people. I mean, they're duck. They'll duck. They'll clearly acknowledge that you're trying to kill them, but they're just sort of nonchalant about it. I guess they feel that way about property damage too. You can walk into anybody's house and smash their their furniture, oh. and they're just, they're just like, okay, nothing I can do. I guess. Do I'm pretty sure in the entire legend. I'm pretty sure in the entire Legend of Zelda series, the only guy who's ever reacted to you breaking stuff is, like, the dude with the fucking pumpkin, with, like, the pumpkins, but then even after, like, the first time, he's like, meh. <laughs> mm -hmm. He's kind of mad about you wasting- oh, there we go. Wasting food. Yeah. Just kind of mad. Just a little bit. All right. well, I don't know. I don't know about kind of. That was, those were all capital letters he was speaking in, so. Oh, maybe. Yeah. He was pretty mad, but his anger did not last uh, for a very long time. Let's see, how do I get out of here? Wait. What do you got? If you're done with your errand, let's get out of here. Come on! Okay. That's how Link, Link temporarily gains superpowers. Either that or... <laughs> You didn't, have, you didn't have to attack the bat. You didn't have to. <laughs> Progress! I'm wondering what would happen. I, I don't know, like, you know what Nintendo needs to do? They need to throw us the fuck off. They actually need to create a game with civilians who get pissed off when you break their stuff. And not just, like, pissed off, but, like, they hold a fucking grudge about it, you know? Like, you break one of their pots and they're like, I shall punish the children for the sins of the father! Like, what the? <laughs> you shall be haunted for generations! Like, Jesus! I don't know, that might be a bit much. Nah. By the way, I think you bumped your camera a little bit. It's a little off-center with the screen. Oh, well. Excuse me. There we go. Now I can see. How do I get up there? I don't know if we've been in all the homes yet. I, yeah. I haven't been. Here we go. I'm trying there we to go. figure out a way to get up. Well, that did not work. <laughs> Good work. <laughs> I was amazing. I don't know about you, though. <laughs> all right. I'm going to jump through this glass window like a. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I'm imagining, like, the more realistic version of that, where, like, either he hits oh, the glass cool. and it doesn't break, and he just falls to the ground, oh. like, <sighs> Jesus! Like, either that, or he smashes through the... He smashes through the window, and then he just comes out with broken glass embedded in his skull. Well, like, blood good. dripping down his face, and he's like, I did it! <laughs> <laughs> and then he, just then he just collapses on the floor. <laughs> You got you gotta love uh you gotta love like movie glass you know yeah or I guess glass in any form of like fiction mm -hmm. I guess it's like breaking through fucking construction paper yep there we go come on little guy god damn it squeeze in through here do 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 looking at my butt. There you are. Well, I know how to solve this. This is a situation that can be solved by arson! Uh, by the way, I love how this place is, is 
says, everything says flammable, and there's a bl broken lantern right here. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you know, I guess we could I, we could blame you for blowing up the bomb uh, the bomb shop or whatever, but honestly, I feel like that's the fault of <laughs> partially the fault of the owner. Yep. He shares some uh, he shares some of the responsibility. <laughs> Sorry, but as romantic as this is, you know, watching things burn and all, I'm not gonna stay here with you. I'm getting out. <laughs> she even says that watching things burn and explode is romantic. No, she. I'm pretty sure she meant it like. Uh... Dying together is. Oh, okay. Oh, like that. There's oh, a, like a, a. There's a romanticism to. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure that's what we meant, but we're gonna interpret it as watching things burn. 